Okay, guys. Of course, the freaking train comes right now. So, yeah. So, this is one of those I'm on a lunch break video, and I'm going to shoot one out as fast as I can. I get so many questions that it's like, it's crazy. And so, I never know which one to talk about until I actually push record. All right. So, this video is going to be about Target weight loss in specific areas like mostly the boobs the breasts um, and I will say that if you're trying to lose weight there the best way is just to do cardio you can do simple body weight exercises like the easiest push-ups um, and I only say push-ups because they're the easiest thing that I can think of that will work your 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 pectoralis <laughs> pecs your pecs Yes, because some guys think that women don't have pecs, but yes, we do have we do have pecs just like you. You can do presses where you're laying on your back. If you want to be able to do um, work your core at the same time, you can do it on a stability ball where you lay on your back and the stability ball is on your upper back and you can just do presses up with whatever weight that you decide to use that'll be good as well well I've kinda got both spectrums whether it be women that are heavier on top that want to um, be a little smaller or that have noticed with weight gain they've gotten bigger boobs are just fat I mean that's all it is is it's fat so if, as you lose weight most women as you do lose weight you will lose them as well now with me I lost I lost some inches when I started losing weight, which I don't necessarily mind it all too much. I'm just hoping that I don't lose any more because I need all that I have. I mean, I guess technically all you really need is a a handful or a mouthful, but <laughs> but that's getting off the subject. Okay, so basically, um, I'll try to be more serious about the subject because I know that the questions that you guys send me are you're being serious. And so I owe you that much. Um, so if you want to lose it, it's just fat. So it's a matter of doing, uh, incorporating a, a balance between um, cardio workouts, cardiovascular workouts, and muscle or resistance uh, training. All right. So I would recommend something like three days of cardio and two days of muscles. Um, like I said, you can do push-ups because those are the most easiest and you don't have to use any um, kind of weights or anything like that. If you do want to be more challenging, you can lift, um, maybe do some tens and do maybe three sets of 12 of the presses. Um, and as you um, get stronger, you can either increase your weight and drop your reps or um, you can just stick with the same the weight and just do more reps. Um, it's entirely up to you. Um, but I know that that's one of the questions I get the most from women. You get some that just do not want to lose what they have. I have never been a big fan of targeting specific areas for weight loss. I think it's an overall, you know, thing that you have to do where you have to work everything, every part of your body. And um, in doing that, you're going to lose weight from everywhere. I'm a big fan of cardio. I'm a big fan of running. You guys know that. And so I stress running, um, whether it be um, doing alternate, alternating between running and uh, our jogging and walking, and vice versa. And I know some people say that um, you can walk and burn the same amount of calories as you can running. And you can lie to yourself <laughs> if you want. Make yourself feel better that you're walking and think that you're burning as many calories as you would running. That's not the case. I mean, it's just not the case because when you're running your heart rate's a lot higher so you're burning more calories than you are if you're walking if I'm walking my heart rate might be maybe 65 70 if I'm walking granted I'm just doing a casual walk I'm not power walking but when I run my heart rate is a little higher it's around um, it's about it could be as high as 185 okay so you're talking between walking to running going basically twice as your heart rate's going twice as fast you're gonna burn more calories I do not believe in the myth that you can walk and burn just as many calories as you can running that I mean oh, I cussed didn't I oh darn I'll have to bleep that out but anyway you guys get the point so I really hope I answered the question I know I started to ramble a little bit you guys but um, I'm trying to catch up with these videos as far as the question videos because I have tons of them um, and so I will leave it there um, 
happy Mother's Day to all the mothers out there. Happy Mother's Day to the fathers that are playing double roles because I know that there's a lot of single parents out parenthood there. Parenthood is such a blessing, and I know through all the trials and tribulations of, of parenthood, but you know I, what? could not have any better job than to be a mother. Um, so I'll leave it there, and I hope that you guys have a beautiful day, and I will see you guys on another day in the life of a soldier girl. Later, guys.